Greetings, Flushy Mammals, and welcome back to a Guilty Gear Strive news video. I know I'm a little bit late on this one, uh, but I didn't have time to make a video when the news dropped, so I'm doing one now. So today, I'm going to be bringing you guys all the details on the Guilty Gear Strive open beta, everything that you need to know. So without further ado, let's get into it. So first things first, let's talk about the beta dates. So there are two different dates, uh, those for who have pre-ordered the game and for those who have not. So the dates for the people that have pre-ordered the game, uh, the beta will start on February 17th, whereas for the people who did not pre-order the game, uh, it will start on the 18th. So people who have pre-ordered Guilty Gear Strive already will have access to the open beta one day early which overall is kind of meh, it doesn't really mean too much. Uh, so if you are okay with just waiting an extra day to try out the open beta, go for it. But if you already know that you're going to want to play Guilty Gear Strive when it launches, go ahead and pre-order. You, you get one day early access, and if you get the uh, deluxe or ultimate editions, you actually get the game three days early. So just a little tip for you guys that might be on the fence of pre-ordering it but know that you're going to buy the game day one anyway. All right, so moving on to the playable characters. Now, this is actually pretty damn cool. 13 of the 15 characters that are going to be in Guilty Gear Strive will be playable in this beta. The only characters that are not playable in this beta are Anji and the 15th character. So that means during this beta, you will have access to Soul. Kai, Mei, Axel, Chip, Potemkin, Faust, Milia, Zato, Ramathal, Leo, Nagoriyuki, and Giovanna. So both of the brand new characters and all of these other mainstay characters as well, you will have access to during the open beta, which is pretty insane, honestly. They're giving us access to basically the entire roster, but two characters. Honestly, I kind of thought that it was going to be similar to the closed beta, where we only had access to Soul Kai, Mei, Axel, Chip, Potemkin, and Faust. But this is pretty damn cool. So uh, yeah, moving on to the modes. Now you'd think that with the open beta, we'd only have access to the online just like in the closed beta, but that is false. We have access to four modes, people, four. We have access to the offline versus. So if you don't feel like playing online, you can just play against some computers. You'll have access to the tutorial, which is insane. Now, the next one, of course, is going to be the network mode, which is the online mode, which will include the rollback netcode. So if you guys don't know, the closed beta was actually being played on delay-based netcode, whereas the open beta, the beta coming up, will be played on rollback netcode, the brand new rollback, which I have absolute, complete faith that this rollback is going to be good, considering how well they implemented rollback netcode into uh, Guilty Gear Accent Core. So the final mode, and this one is huge for a lot of people, you're actually going to be having access to the training mode as well. So if you don't want to play online at all, and you don't want to touch the online whatsoever, and you just want to figure out some characters during the beta, the training mode is there for you. So you'll have access to versus, tutorial, training, and online. This is a pretty big amount of modes for us to have access to just in the open beta. Have some fun with that one, guys. All right, guys, so that is about it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, remember to leave a like, subscribe for more Guilty Gear Strive content, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. It's been casual.